Now therefore, I, Woodrow Wilson, President of the United States of America, do hereby proclaim to all whom it may concern that a state of war exists between the United States and the Imperial German government. Um, so the convincing things were, of course, um, in particular, the Germans' resumption of unrestricted submarine warfare. Um, they had done some of this earlier in the war, particularly in uh, 1915, when they sunk the Lusitania, which was a British passenger ship that also um, carried Americans on it. Um, but they resumed it again after having stopped for a while in January of 1917. Um, and of course started sinking Allied uh, shipping, including U.S. shipping. American ships have been sunk. American lives taken in ways which it has stirred us very deeply to learn of. The rationale, of course, being that Britain uh, couldn't feed itself. Roughly half of all of Britain's food had to be imported. Most of the natural resources on which British industry relied had to be imported. And the Germans reasoned, uh, and they were quite precise as to the number of tons they had to uh, take care of in 1917, but the Germans were quite precise that if, it, if they could sink a certain number of tons of Allied shipping per month in 1917, they could bring, bring in their estimation, bring Britain to its knees. But he decided after the resumption of unrestricted submarine warfare, um, and actually after the Zimmerman telegram sort of convinced him, the Germans weren't going to do that. So the U.S. would have to get involved and then could be involved in making a peace. It is a fearful thing to lead this great peaceful people into war, into the most terrible and disastrous of all wars, civilization itself seeming to be in the balance. We left in the 1916, and we came back in February 1917, and we were home in about a month, and we were called out for World War I. So we had to go down to Camp Douglas again, six regiments of uh, infantry from, uh, camp, uh, from the National Guard, plus two uh, regiments from Michigan. We put them all together down at Waco, Texas, and made 32nd Division.